Hey everyone, today is January 23rd and this is Mondays with the Mayor. Hope everyone had an amazing weekend. We all kind of woke up to kind of cold weather and uh, actually Humboldt Unified School District had a school snow day today because of ice. So if you're out and about, try to be aware of the, the black ice that does exist. So uh, keep that in mind. What do we got going on this week? Wednesday is a blood drive here over at Prescott Valley at the library on the third floor of the Crystal Room. Uh, they prefer that you make an appointment uh, if you're going to donate blood. And one of the things is, uh, if you donate blood, you're going to get a free ticket to the Renaissance Festival down south in Golden Valley. So kind of a little bit reward, uh, but otherwise it's just a good thing to do, folks. Donate blood. What else we got going on? Um, Prescott Valley, the, on February 2nd, which is this Thursday, or next Thursday, I'm sorry, at the right after town council will be our uh, public open house for our drainage study. So if you ever wondered what's going on or how our, how our town basically during monsoon season, some areas uh, get a lot more water than others, uh, our drainage system uh, needs to be evaluated. So that is what's happening. So if you have some input, some personal knowledge in regards to what's been happening in your neighborhood, the consultants, they would love to hear it. So please join us, 5.30 to 7, Library Auditorium, um, February 2nd. So that'll be after our work study meeting that starts around 3 o'clock. So uh, again, check it out next week. What else we got going on? Speaking of things that we had going on last week was uh, our budget process. So that started. Uh, we usually start in January, and basically what it is, we come, come up with ideas and questions and what we can do differently for the town, and then uh, we turn it back over to staff. They put together their ideas, and then eventually it makes its way back to town council for final approval. So if you have any ideas, any thoughts, uh, any comments, we'd love to hear from you. Uh, I'd like to give a shout-out to Prescott Valley Police Officer Matt Wilson. Uh, a great officer was recently promoted to sergeant uh, with the Prescott Valley Police Department. Uh, Matt, a uh, little fun fact, is I actually taught Matt at Yavapai College, heck, it was probably 14 years ago, when I took over a class for the late Ed Cedar, and Matt Wilson was in that class. So uh, I think it's kind of funny. Uh, him and I joke about that, and he is really, uh, truly a, a great asset. So if you see Matt out and about, congratulate him. What else we got going on? We can talk about some road stuff. Prescott East Highway is on schedule to be completed this month. So that's exciting news for the residents over there on Prescott East. We've been working with the Applied County and uh, it's really a great project. So if you had a chance, you can kind of check it out. The road's still closed on some portions, but if you're coming from Sunset, you can drive down Sunset and go south and you can kind of see what's been happening over there. So I know the residents are really excited and it's uh, really great news um, about the money that we've been putting in over in that area of town. What else we got going on? Um, talking about roads, ADOT is going to be closing their bid process for Highway 69 from Truewood to Stone Ridge. So that's an entire mill and fill, which is basically a redo of the entire road. So they're collecting bids up until February 9th, and then uh, after that, hopefully they're scheduling for late spring, early summer to get that worked on. So I know for anyone that's driven down Highway 69, you know, it's a uh, could use a could use a, a whole makeover, so that's exciting. And what else have we got coming up? Coming up next week, folks. This is a, a hot topic among some people, but uh, the town of Prescott Valley is going to be reviewing the policy of allowing chickens and rabbits uh, at home. So, for those of you that are interested in um, having rabbits or having chickens, here's your opportunity to uh, come to town council, uh, express your interest, or if you're against it, we'd love to hear what you have to say. Uh, pretty much every community around us allows it as well as down in the Maricopa County area. So it's something that it's about time that council looks at. So again, stay tuned. We'll be putting out more information in regards to chickens and rabbits in town. And uh, that's pretty much it. Folks, one of the things you, you hear about what the town does and what we do for communication wise, um, for those of you on Facebook, um, Instagram, Twitter, you see about Mondays with the mayor all the time. We actually open it up to those individuals that just get their information on next door. So. Welcome everyone on next door. This is what Mondays with the Mayor is like, and uh, we always finish it out with a dad joke. People sometimes call it a bad joke, but I like to call them a dad joke. So, why don't you wear your snow boots? It's because they will melt. Okay? <laughs> boots they, snow, they would melt. Folks, have a great week. We'll see you next time.